tonight on First Look, we are checking out the country's best getaways. But between the traffic, traveling, and time commitments, it's hard to find time to let go and relax. That is until you pass through the Golden Door, America's first full-scale spa. The Golden Door is a really special place. It's magical. It's a place where you can come and leave the entire world behind. It's a place for relaxation, a place for healing, a place for restoration. Here you find this peace and tranquility that you would hope to find in a, like a Zen monastery. You walk through that Golden Door, you set your bags down, and the world is gone. Nick, the grounds here are so beautiful. I already feel the stress melting away. You don't even feel like you're in California anymore. We're modeled after a Japanese uh, mountain inn. So guests come here for the week to get away from all the stresses. What kind of activities do you guys offer? Each program for each guest completely catered to what they want to do. So from 5.30 in the morning mm -hmm. all the way until 6.15 when they have dinner, they don't have to think about what activity comes next. This sounds like my kind of place. Do you mind if I take you on a little hike? Let's do it. All right. Okay. This would be the start to a pretty challenging hike. As you can see, it goes straight up. How many hiking trails are there? We actually have over 20 miles of hiking trails on the property. Wow. Along with these calming bamboo trails, you can also stroll through the avocado groves, Japanese gardens, and the serene waterfalls that adorn the property. These oak trees are amazing. Some of them are over 100 years old, and they grow all over the property. Wow. So what do you think of our grounds? It's picturesque. It's so beautiful. I love it. And with nature surrounding us at every step, it's only fitting that the Golden Door also has a golden garden. Jeff, I have to say, most retreats don't have a garden like this. We grow the produce for the kitchen, which mm -hmm. feeds up to 40 visitors a day, three times a day. Farmed to table. Yeah, what gets picked this morning will go into the kitchen and it'll be on the plate for lunch and dinner, and then we'll do it again tomorrow morning. What do you call this philosophy? It's fresh and it's special. Mm -hmm. It's fresh. -al. It's fresh. -al. <laughs> and soon it'll be my lunch, starting with some scallions. You just reach down there and yank on it, and it'll come out. We take off some of the dead leaves. Then some cilantro. So if we cut it a couple mm -hmm. inches above the bottom of the plant, it'll come back and, and oh. we'll get more leaves out of it. And finally, just a few bay leaves. That smells good. You can cut it right there, and then you'll have enough to present to the chef. But before I get to cooking, I could use a little rejuvenation. I'm in dire need of a good massage and facial. I'm in for a treat. It smells amazing. Wow, this one smells really good too. Balance the pH on the skin. My skin felt so hydrated, I definitely had the Golden Door Glow. I'm very relaxed. And also very hungry. I'm ready to see what Chef Greg is going to create with my bounty from the garden. We're not cooking the traditional spa cuisine because really what I want our guests to realize is that they can eat healthy and eat real food mm -hmm. and eat that way at home. It's very colorful here. Color is good. Color yeah. means lots of nutrients. And with this vibrant palette of produce, we're making a doll. This is called Masor Dal. It's named after pink lentils, and dal okay. is an Indian dish. We're going to start with our pumpkins. So these are Jaredel pumpkins. And then we add our spice. Go for it. Go big or go home. We're going to let this sit on the stove until the pumpkin starts to sweat a little bit. Mm -hmm. So onions, onions are going to go into the pan. Go ahead and throw the lentils in. Ooh. Bingo. Now, you collected some bay leaves out earlier. I did. Just okay. toss them in holes so we can pull them out. Then we combine our caramelized onions with the pumpkin and lentil mixture and add in ginger, garlic, and chilies for heat. So we'll just do a little bit. This okay. is going to be mild. Okay. Last but not least, cilantro that we picked out from the garden. Now let's plate it up and let's go eat. Sounds good. Watch some yes. pomegranate iced tea. Thank you. You're welcome. This pumpkin is delicious. If you're someone who hasn't eaten vegetarian before and you get to have this, you may actually eat some vegetables once in a while. It was not a boring dish at all. You can eat healthy and still spice it up. Everything about this place is amazing, so cheers. cheers. After experiencing the Golden Door, my daily routine of traffic and travel seems miles away. And I'd say this is the perfect end to all of my getaway adventures.